Okay, let's see here. Love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. I've been captured. I was playing easy, and I ran up to him. I was like, Dad, good. Then, <gasps> there he is. He's looking at me. Here is the long girl. She is a blue eyeless sunset ball python. This results in a stark white snake with blue eyes. Shy? Very shy. Mom, why are you recording me? little girl back because she will be eating tonight. This snake here is a ball python, which is one of the most popular pet snakes. They are also known as royal pythons because, according to legend, Queen Cleopatra liked to wear these snakes as a form of living jewelry. I made humid hides for both of my snakes. Even if their ambient humidity is perfect, I want to give them access to a more humid microclimate. Thar started drinking the air. It's becoming increasingly obvious. I can deny it no longer. I am small. What's this hole? Yeah, I am free. <laughs> Just a little further. I know stop. Better luck next time. His hiss. This is the legendary blue nope rope, native to the Komodo and other surrounding Indonesian islands. They're venomous, if you couldn't tell from that head and bright coloration. Look at that face, look at those eyes, look at the water. It's on its head, it's on its body, its body's blue. And look at it, it's skinny, it's perfect for hiding in the trees. Oh my, oh wow, I need this animal.
Emma Gucci on. I go in my Louis Vuitton, but even with nothing on, bet I made you look. I made you look. Yeah, I look good in my Versace dress, but I'm hotter when my morning hairs. Look at this little guy. He's got a hoodie on. He's got a little hoodie on. No, we're not gonna go. You got some shed, dude. I'm oh, mine. Look at him go. He's scooting. Look at him scoots. He's going as hard as he can. Oh, look at these are trying so hard. He's got the little scoots. Look, he's trying to be big and puff up his neck. Oh, he's so small. He's trying. He can do it though. Look how cute he is. Look at that dumb thing. Oh, he's mad. I'm sorry, dude. I'm just trying to help you out. It's like cobra. It's trying to act like a little cobra. Oh, little hissy baby. Stop this at once. So here's a video for anyone who wants to see a snake actually think about something. So I'm getting Kiara out right now so I can clean her enclosure, but before this I was mixing up some powdered rupashi for my fish, so my hands smell like the insectivore diet, which is something she's never smelled before, and you can see her trying to figure out what the heck is on my hands. What she's doing right here is she's gathering scent particles with the forks on her tongue and putting her tongue into the Jacobson's organ on the roof of her mouth so that she can try and analyze and figure out what the smell is. She knows it doesn't smell like food, but she's also not quite sure what to make of it either. She's gonna sit there, she's gonna think about it for a little bit, and then she's just gonna decide, eh, whatever. I'd rather come out of the enclosure than think too long about that anyway. So while snakes are a very instinctive animal, they can absolutely use the little brains that they have in their heads there when they gotta think about something. Do ba 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 do.